my mother um, has put forth a plan, and actually one of the first plans that she put forth after she formally announced her candidacy um, was a program to um, pay for getting every child in our country in pre-kindergarten within a decade. Um, currently, only about half our kids are in pre-kindergarten across the country, um, and only about 25% are in publicly funded pre-kindergarten. I didn't know when I became a mom that one of the great gifts I would receive uh, would be watching my parents as grandparents, um, in part because I, I don't remember them with me as an infant or a toddler. Um, and so watching how much they love my daughter and how interested and engaged they are in every aspect of her life, whether they're reading to her or singing to her. She loves Wheels on the Bus, so that's a big family activity is singing Wheels on the Bus. Everyone we know gets on the bus, every animal gets on the bus, yes, cows can even get on the bus. Um, and watching uh, just the care and attention and how much joy they get out of the everyday moments of helping uh, her eat dinner or feed her a bottle or putting her to bed has just been such a gift and I hadn't anticipated that gift and so I think that's made it all the more precious. Um, I certainly know that becoming a grandmother has only deepened um, my mother's resolve to work on issues like those related to early learning and early childhood that have brought us here together today and also um, was one of the real reasons she decided to run for president um, to help ensure that every child would have the opportunities that we will be blessed to be able to provide our daughter um, because she knows that's not only um, the right thing to do uh, for our country, um, but also because she wants that to be the country that Charlotte grows up in.